This is how the power connection and lubrication of a P-Notch OML lathe should be done. First of all, we must connect the three facies. L1, L2, L3, and ground in the places enabled for this purpose in the electrical panel of the machine. To check that this operation has been done correctly, we plug the lathe cable to the power supply, give power to the machine, and verify at the phase relay that there is tension in all the cables. If the connection has been made correctly, the two pilot lights on the relay will be illuminated. If this is not the case, the facies must be interchanged until the connection is correct. For security reasons, Pinkaho ML series lathes are delivered to the customer with empty oil tanks, so it is absolutely necessary to fill them before starting the machine. Lubrication reservoirs are available for the headstock, Norton box, and apron. The lubricant tanks are equipped with a filling device, an emptying device, and a fill level indicator. P-Notch OML lathes are equipped with a lubrication pump for the headstock, which has the function of lubricating the two bearings of the main spindle. When we start our P-Notch lathe, the pump starts up. If there is a pressure shortage, the machine will not start. We will proceed to fill the oil tanks of the headstock, the Norton box, and the apron. The headstock tank has two oil level viewers. The Norton box is a mechanism composed of a set of gears that allow the manual change of speed to set different feeds and thread pitches. The tank is properly filled when the lubricant level reaches the red dot in the center of the oil level indicator. The apron contains all the mechanisms that transmit the movement to the cross slide. There is a hand pump on the apron which is used to lubricate the guides of the cross slide, longitudinal slide, and transverse screw. It is advisable to pump lubricant several times a day during the use of the lathe for optimum performance. Once the three tanks have been filled and the lathe has been used, the Airy 50.3 may appear on the driver display. This display is located in the electrical cabinet of the lathe. Airy 50.3 can mean a pressure or lubrication level failure of the headstock. To solve this failure and to be able to start up our P-Notch OML lathe, we must check the oil tank of the headstock is in its proper pressure level so that the pump pressure is between 3 and 4 bar. On P-Notch OML series lathes, other elements such must also be lubricated. The chariot, tail stock, turning bars, and lead screw. An adequate preventive maintenance plan, according to the hours of use foreseen for each machine, guarantees the optimization of the useful life of the machines.